out of the generator. They must have just turned on that slurry pump. Hey, look at this, dude. Is that a bolt hole missing? Yeah. Jason and Al discover that loose nuts on the slurry pump system are already causing problems. See that plunger yeah. that's up there? Yeah, it's up there now. Yeah, so that plunger tells you how full it is. If it starts to drop down, we, we can pick up, it up. up our, our RPM. This one's not even tight. There's another one in there. I'm gonna go look at the sluice and see if there's enough. All right, I'll take care of this. I'm gonna go and see if we got enough water to even sluice with. That's the right size? I don't know, yeah. Uh, that, this one doesn't work. Right there, Jason. That one's shut. What? This one's shut. Good. We got water. The question is, do we have enough for the sluice? What do you think? That's it. That'll do it. We got white water. That's enough. That's it, right there. Hey, that pump's amazing, man. Dude, she goes, don't she? <laughs> it's amazing. That's enough to sluice right there. That's the best I've ever seen it. Al, turn the trouble on, Al. Turn it on, yeah! Okay, Slowly drop some in. Let's just give this a shot. So far, so good. The whole mass is running some dirt. Here we go. I don't know how this is going to go, but we'll take it, man. Hey, Al, how we doing? It's kind of stabilized. OK. This flurry pump is amazing because everything at the other plant, we got to move away from the plant with excavators. This we use a pump to do all that work for us. So if this is working right, it's saving us a lot of man hours. How long? I don't know. But today and right now, at this very second, we're getting gold. 